Hi guys, it's me Swastik and this is part 3 of how to make your own discord bot using python and in this video we'll be learning moderation commands. So let's start. The first command is the clear command. If you haven't seen it being used, it just deletes the latest messages. So if I write clear 2, it will delete the latest 2 messages. So let's make the command. Now I will change the prefix because I have my bot already, um, I, I changed the bot so I made this into my bot. So I'll be changing the prefix to something else like um, the I think hashtag is fine. So the prefix is hashtag now. So let's just uh, make our clear command. So at the rate client dot command and alias. I want the alias to be C. So alias is C now and async def clear. Now in here you need to pass in the CTX like I said before and for a parameter we'll be passing in amount. Now if you don't enter the amount I want them I want it to automatically delete the last message. So 2. So what is this gonna do? If the amount is not passed in it will take the default amount as 2. So let's just uh, uh, so the amount will be 2. Now to make to actually delete the message it's just one line of code ctx dot channel dot purge so the method is purge and the inside the purge uh, method there is one parameter limit equals to amount so what this does if I save it um, and run it so I'll be running it using command prompt and uh, what this does is it deletes the latest two messages let me just navigate to the correct directory tutorial bot not not turbo c plus plus tutorial bot and let's just run bot.py let's see if it works as you can see he's ready now so let's just try using him so clear two as you can see that just deleted the message and if i just type clear it would delete two messages now since I'm gonna be deleting a lot because I'm gonna be deleting something like five messages there you go deleted a lot of messages so now but there is one problem with this what will happen is if somebody writes if I just um, I don't know is he online he's not online so if anybody types clear this will trigger and it will delete the messages so we don't want that to happen we only want someone who can actually read the messages like our moderators to uh, be able to delete it delete the messages so let's go back and for permissions just type another um, decorator so another add rate symbol client sorry not cli client commands dot has permission has underscore permission permissions it's uh, plural so permissions um, the permission is manage manage underscore manage uh, messages I think so manage messages equals to true so what this will do is just check if I can like if I'm allowed to check if I'm if I have the permissions of um, managing messages only then will this trigger if this if the person does not have the message it will give us an error in right there it will give us an error so let's just check this so to check that I'm gonna go on to my alt and show you what happens if I uh, try to say something so for some reason discord isn't letting me open my alt so I'll be just asking someone to do it for me and I'll be back when they type this for me so as you can see uh, he typed and it didn't work so and if I just show this to you as well if I go back as you can see it says you are missing manage permissions to run this command so it worked so let's now make our click uh, kick and ban commands so to make our kick command we just need to copy this because it's almost the same and um, just switching out some stuff like alias I want it to be K and uh, the member so the permission that for kicking is kick underscore members so one thing if you have any doubts about anything you can refer to the documentation and this is the link and I'll just provide the links in the description below as well 
so just search for whatever you want to search for and hit go and as you can see discord of permissions dot kick members and as you can see kick members it returns true if the user can kick users from the guild you can look up anything you want everything is in here okay so let's just go back now to kick people i don't want it to be like this right so kicking i just need let me just change the name as well because don't want to be clear again so async def kick the context and then i want um the person to be kicked so member now if we want to take this as a discord dot member object we need to write colon and discord dot m capital member so this will take the member as a member object so if you pa if you mention the member it will work if you write their name it will work if you um, have if you just enter their id it will work so member and the next is the reason so for the reason i'm just going to write reason like this now why do we put this asterisk this is so that if we don't have uh, this asterisk reason will be just the first word with uh, f the first word will be used as a reason but if we use this asterisk what it does is every word after the member it will be added to reason so now to kick the person it's simply member dot kick and in here you just need to pass in the reason equal to reason so what this does is um, um, this will just kick the member and the reason will be the reason now I'm just gonna have the default reason to be um, reason not provided no reason provided because um, if someone wants to kick uh, the member really quickly without just providing the reason no reason provided now just to see that it actually works what we'll do is have await um, CDX uh, no we'll actually DM them as well that you've been kicked so to DM someone it's simply uh, seat uh, member dot send so you just send the message to the member and it just say you have been kicked from you have been kicked from the coding community so what this does is it will DM them saying you have been kicked and you can also add your link to join you can also add the reason so this is important uh, so because because if I can spell this correctly because and the reason you can just add it like this so so this will just also tell them the reason why they were kicked so let's just save this and let me ask someone to um, do this for me now I'm just gonna make the ban as well so that we can do this in one go so client dot command just B then just change kick to ban members and uh, have our not bam ban members then the command should be ban and it's literally the same thing you don't have to change anything just um just change this to banned and uh, and it's also just ban that's it you it's literally the same thing just the kick replace it ban so um, just save that and um, let's see who is willing to be banned from my server now you do need to reset your bot to do this and um, every time you change something you need to reset your bot so let's now someone agreed to be kicked so let's just kick them so to do that just type uh, uh, like the uh, kick someone and reason test okay let's see test one two three let's see if our bot is online first he's ready let's see if it works so we kick him and as you can see he disappeared from this side and if I try to ping him as you can see he doesn't exist wait he exists and he is uh, not in the server as you can see so let's just ask him to join back and send us the DMs and as you can see um, it DM'd him saying you have been kicked from the coding community because test one two three so it works now we can also ban him uh, this will be uh, using this so ban uh, let's just ban someone and reason is no reason let's not provide a reason let's see what happens as you can see we managed to okay, they didn't get banned why didn't it work 
didn't work because okay so they um we cannot send them a message so what happens is if you like if you're trying to send them a message and their dms are closed you'll not be able to ban them so to do that you can just either not send them a message or put this in a try and accept so i'll be that's more advanced so let's just not send them a message and just say um he has been banned so to do that just have member uh, dot name uh, has been banned okay no, let's just and let's not send that to them instead send it to us ctx dot send okay so let's see if it works let's go back and uh, let's reset our bot and i'll be back when the bot is reset so i just reset the bot and let's just ban him now so to ban him the way i do it is ban b a n ban and i'm just going to copy that copies id to show you that it works with the id as well let's ban him as you can see tapu has been banned from the coding community because no reason provided so that's it for today guys if you like the video hit the like button and subscribe and in the next video i'll be talking about unban and uh, a feature called call all staff so if you want to see that hit the like button because the like goal for this video is um, about i guess 20 likes so if it hits 20 likes i'll make the new video and okay bye